I have some very nice slingshots that I made over the week. So uh, first of all it's this multiplex version of the Phoenix. So um, you probably recognize it from my how-to video. But I thickened the grip and I gave it like a palm swell. And it's, it's a small slingshot but with a fat grip which I really like. Beautiful to hold. And also like the multiplex better. It's a great shooter too. Let's shoot. It does give you a hand slap, but it feels great to hold it. So this next one is closely related to this one because it's also from the Phoenix family. You see the fork is very comparable, but this is made for this, taking the strongest bands that I have and it has a few unique features to allow me to do that. So first of all it has this notch here that is holding the slingshot against the back of your hand so that you have a solid grip on it. Then also it has this lanyard which you slip around your wrist so now it's double secured by the lanyard and by the notch here. Also it has this shield that's why I call it the shield. See, this is one of the biggest issues with strong bands. They come back after the shot and hit your hand. And with strong bands, it can be really painful because these bands weigh more than the ammo that the slingshot shoots. So there's a lot of energy in it. And the constant slap of the band on your knuckles is really painful. Uh, it can even hurt you. Well, this of course is so solid that nothing can ever happen. So this protects you. It's also very strong because this has been laminated against the original slingshot frame, the two part. So they support the frame and make it strong enough for even the strongest bands. Which in this case are two layers of TheraBand black full width. So we got 28 centimeter band width at the fork side. Okay, now in order to shoot the 20 millimeter steel ball with these heaviest bands that I've ever put on a slingshot. What I do is I use the mechanical release because it helps me to pull harder. Very hard pull. Okay. <laughs> okay, so this third and last one is my tiniest slingshot and it's been made from a little clamp that my wife discovered in the do-it-yourself market and it even has a magnet where you can attach your BBs because it shoots steel BBs. And of course you can clamp it against the loop of your trousers. And it's not a powerful shooter, but it's really fun and it's great for indoor blinking. You just shoot like this. It's fun. <laughs> That's it for today. Thanks and bye bye guys. <laughs>